I downloaded this clip from the link in the description and dropped it on the timeline here in Premiere Pro. And I want to adjust the speed of the clip at certain times, maybe speed it up a little bit and then go back to normal speed. But I want the speed change to happen gradually, not suddenly. So in this timeline, let's click here and drag up to expand this track. Right click on the clip, go to show clip keyframes, time remapping, and then click speed. Or if you right click on this tiny FX button, then you can go to time remapping speed. This will display a white track on top and a line or a rubber band that controls the speed underneath it. If you drag this rubber band up or down, you'll be increasing or decreasing the speed of the clip. Hold down shift while dragging to limit the speed change values to 5% increments. Let's undo that. And with the selection tool activated, hover the cursor over the rubber band, hold down the control or command key and click once to add a keyframe. So at this point in time, we want the clip to go faster. Let's create another one here as well, where we want the clip to go back to normal speed. You can then adjust their positions by holding down Alt or Option and dragging them left and right. Now, in between these two keyframes, go ahead and drag the rubber band up to make the clip faster. I'll set it all the way to 600%. So now if I preview the clip, it starts at 100% speed, goes up to 600%, and then goes back to 100. I'm gonna press Alt and reposition those. Great, but that's not what we want. We want a gradual speed change. What's the gradual speed change? Well, these keyframes can be split in half to create a transition between them. Simply drag the right half of the speed keyframe to the right or the left half to the left. And this will create a gradual speed change. You can see the rubber band indicating a transition from 100% to 600% speed. Not only that, click to select the keyframe. And do you see this tiny blue thing here? This is actually a curve control and you can drag either of its handles to adjust the acceleration and deceleration of the speed change, creating an ease in and ease out effect. Let's preview the video. And now we have a nice gradual speed change. And you can always move the keyframes left and right by clicking and dragging the white control track between the split keyframes. This is how you can speed up your clips, but you can use the same technique to slow them down.